The somewhat sad northern French landscape is the backdrop for Paris-Roubaix, especially when it's dry. I find Paris-Roubaix beautiful. In dust clouds, Roumont the riders in their brightly colored shirts. And then, of course, begins the incredible hectic. Following cars, the crowd cheering, applauding the riders. To me, a complete inferno. I think, fantastic. The struggle for life, it's about winning, it's about losing, it's about everything which matters in life. Okay, why do I paint uh, Paris-Roubaix? Uh, of course, every race has got its own charm. But to me, it's Paris-Roubaix. It's the most dramatic, it's the most picturesque race ever. Um, on the day of the course, the landscape changes. Normally, it's kind of sad. You've got low horizons, impressive skies. But on the day of the course, thousands of people, they gather around the final cobblestone. In this race, my favorite type of bike racer uh, gets born or he stands up. They call him the Flanderian. The Flanderian, that's a guy who, who is strong enough to fight all the elements. I mean, the expression in the faces of the, of the riders, the fantastic yellow shirt in this case, uh, the helicopter, uh, the, the spectators, maybe you recognize him. These, these riders are trying to hook up. The team manager is often very, very far behind because the roads are so narrow. This is what I mean when I'm talking about the dust. And this is also very typical. On every cobblestone road, uh, on every part, you have a, a sign. No problems at all. Everybody is bike. Fan. Hey, this is one of the paintings uh, which shows how hard the race is, how tough the race is. I mean, look at the faces, they are almost like a green mask. Of course, there's a winner. This year, 2012, it was again Tom Bone. You see him in this painting as a leader, followed by the cameraman, uh, uh, applauded by the public. Um, they, they, of course, the Flemish fans, they are going wild because this is their man. He is ahead. And you see um, everybody is in full excitement because Tom Bonin is leading. In the sand landscape, at least you've got advertisements. In this painting I try to, well, uh, uh, to emphasize the hectic. I, I use cars, I cut them off, and that way you get some uh, speed in the painting, uh, the, f the, the riders are in a sort of perspective of the car and then a spectator uh, who cheers. Allez, allez!
it's 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 got everything. It's like Jericho, who painted this Medusa. To me, Paris Roubaix, it's my Medusa. It's the struggle for life. It's about death. It's about joy. It's about drama. It's about hope. It's about losing. So all of this, that's in my paintings. And I guess that's why I like to paint Paris Roubaix. Thank you.